teamed up with Harkila, specialists in outdoor wear for shooting, hunting and hiking. I've been invited to head office to see why their clothes are renowned worldwide for quality and performance. In this playlist we're going beneath the fabric, you'll see some of the best and newest pieces that are available and soon to come. Good afternoon. Um, I'm going to show you something new now. This is actually not going to hit the shops until March next year. So we're a little early, but we thought we'd show, tempt you with some of our new products that are coming out next year. Uh, the designers have been very busy despite lockdown. and They've come up with a couple of cracking pieces, uh, particularly for the stalkers that uh, have sold in very well to the retailers. So you'll see this in many shops, internet sites, etc. Um, the first one is a bum bag. This is designed to be for a stalker because it's, it's kind of thinner and longer than you would normally find. We looked at a lot of these when we made this and they were quite deep and we found that that didn't really work so well for what we want them to do if you're in the hunting world. They're quite wide so you can easily fit a knife or any of the other stalking accoutrement. You've got a decent sized pocket in there. You're not going to take um, lots of stuff but you can easily get a license, a wallet, that sort of thing in there. No problem at all. There is a front pocket with an ammo holder there. So the things you may want in this straight away, you could put in the front and then anything else, gloves, sanitizer, etc., 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 can all fit in here. The bottom is tougher, durable, waterproof. So that if you're putting it down, that's going to be uh, quite tough. At the side, you've got a couple of zip pockets put all sorts of things. I use it for an ammo uh, magazine. At the side, you've got this. I uh, don't know whether you've seen this. It's called the Molly system and you can attach various uh, accessories to it. I'll show you that in a minute, how it works. And there's one on the other side as well. So there's plenty of pockets for all your stuff. You can separate it out and you can add bits and pieces using the Molly system. Really nice, really plain, simple, but just what you need really. The other thing in this series that we've done is our new bino pouch. Now, this is something we've had in the range previously and this is the latest update and I've got to say it's an absolutely cracking update. The pouch itself is designed to take the um, 8x42 binos or something large like the 10 by 50s and rangefinder. So they will fit in here. At the moment, the system that we use uh, is the same as the one we've used previously that's worked very well and that's magnetic. So you just pull that and that is magnetized at the bottom so it doesn't flap around. So if it's on your chest, you actually have to pull it up slightly. It's not gonna flap around. So if you're lying down, it's going to stay where it is. On the inside, that's designed for smaller bino size, but you can take this piece of padding out, so that makes a much bigger area. So that'll really suit the binos with um, a rangefinder attached or the uh, 10 by 50, something like that size. These little pieces attached to your binoculars. Um, so you can attach them to the actual harness itself. This one has a place for a phone, so you can get a iPhone or whatever, and stick it down the back. I've got a big case on mine, but there's a little pocket in here, as you can see, that'll take a phone. And when this is down, it covers up the entrance. So hopefully if it's chucking it down with rain, you'll not get a wet phone. Depends on the size of your phone, I suppose. There are pockets at the side. This is designed not just for a British market, but for a Scandinavian market, particularly Swedish, you'd probably have a, um, a tracker for your dog and a tracker for your mates as well if you were out moose hunting. So you've got a lot of equipment to um, carry and something you need to get quite quickly. Um, there is the Molly system in use here as well. And so you can undo that, just have to do one popper. 
it's a little fiddly, but that pulls through. Then you can take this off and you can take that one off as well. The Molly system is this loop system and that's what these extra pockets fit onto. This could easily fit on the side of the, um, of the bum bag as well, should you want to carry something down there. Um, it goes across the bottom and up the sides. There's a really nice harness for this, fairly infinitely adjustable, and that'll keep them, keep you in absolute control of this. There are clicks, joiners, buckles on every corner, so you can really get in and out of this quite quickly. This, this uh, would hang on to your actual bino, so if you drop them, they wouldn't go very far. And uh, it works extremely well, and putting it back again, again, all magnetic. It comes in this green color, and also this version. So this is the uh, Harkila Lynx camo, and there's the bum bag as well in the same, in the same camouflage. They work in exactly the same way, and um, I, this has sold in extremely well. There's a lot of people interested in these bino pouches now, uh, and particularly ones that take the bigger size uh, binos, the 10 by 50s and range finders, as lots of people are using those. So um, yeah, really looking forward to getting this out on the market. I think the retail price on this one is going to be £99, and uh, 99.99, and um, yeah, looking forward to selling it. You can actually, on this one, take all this off, and there is a belt strap here as well, so you can just put it on a belt if you wanted to but uh, very versatile customize it to how hopefully how you'd need and uh, really nice piece very quiet as well and that concludes these videos hopefully i'll be going back again soon for some more but i hope you've enjoyed these i've really enjoyed putting these together if you have enjoyed these and you're a massive foodie then please hit the subscribe button and i'll see you for the next videos